Hi, I'm Robin Higgins, and this is the chemical equation for the reaction between 2-pentene and bromine. All right, so first let's take a look at 2-pentene. Uh, remember that pentene is our prefix for 5, so we have 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 carbons, and ene is our name for alkenes, which means double bonds, and we were told that this is 2-pentene, which means that our alkene starts on carbon number 2. All right, so we have our 2-pentene uh, and our reaction with bromine. So bromine exists as Br bonded to another Br. All right, and so the way they react is that this alkene actually attacks this first bromine with a partial positive charge. And as that's happening, this bromine also attacks in at this carbon, which is becoming partially positive. And at this point, this bromine pretty much decides to take this lone pair uh, for itself. So the intermediate is that we have still our five carbon uh, backbone here. We have a bromine that now has a full positive charge. Our other bromine, this guy, is just hanging out being fully negative. And at this point, we start making some stereochemistry. So this hydrogen uh, is actually going to be a dash. This is going to be a wedge. And then on the other side, you have this guy being a wedge. We're going to have a dash hydrogen. So uh, this is not very stable because we have a full positive charge on bromine. And so this negatively charged bromine finds it, attacks in, and then this bond goes completely to this positively charged bromine. So our final product is we have, again, our five backboned carbon. But with this stereochemistry, we have two bromines that have added anti. And we have these very specific wedges and dashes. So this is our final product. And so just to give you guys the chemical formula for this, uh, we started with our uh, 2-pentene, which is C5H10, and we added Br2, and then we created a molecule that had the chemical formula C5H10 Br2. So we just added bromine. Um, and I'm Robin Higgins, and this has been the balanced chemical equation for the reaction between 2-pentene and bromine.